This is our seventh annual scholarship celebration, and it's to bring donors and their scholarship recipients together in a spirit of camaraderie and friendship. Our Outstanding Service Awards are given to those donors that um, have given a great deal of support above and beyond to the students at Garden City Community College. We give one for individuals or families and one for corporate or businesses. The Outstanding Service Award for this year for individuals and families is being given to Otis and Mary Lee Moles. Otis and Mary Lee started the Otis and Mary Lee Moles Scholarship last year. It is a scholarship fund that when fully endowed will fund six full fee, full tuition scholarships at Garden City Community College. Three for students whose families are members of the Garden City Co-op and three for students whose families are employees of the Garden City Co-op. Um, they're bettering their community, they're supporting the members of the co-op by creating the scholarship. And so I'm very proud to award them this year's Outstanding Service Award. I'm not going to talk that long this time. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Well, I want to thank you for giving the opportunity to, to help a few kids. And, and I have to thank the Garden City Co-op because they've, over the years, have done so much for us. And I never dreamed when I left high school and went through college that I would be traveling around the world. Most of mine is straight south of here. But Otis, went to China and other places in Europe that I did not go. But a lot of it is because of the co-op, so we thank you too. And they contributed greatly to this scholarship. So you've got friends out there. <laughs> and I think it's really important to have good friends. Thank you. Thank you. And this year, as well as the moles, we have decided to honor the Garden City Co-op. And a few things about the Garden City Co-op that I find really amazing is, just as the college was founded in 1919 and has been changing lives in this community, the Garden City Co-op was also founded in 1919. It was an auspicious year for our community. And so both organizations are heading towards their 100th year, and both organizations do a tremendous job serving the community and helping make Garden City a better place. And Mary Lee is right, when the Garden City Co-op found out that the Moles were creating a, a scholarship fund to benefit uh, members and employees of the Garden City Co-op and their families, um, the Garden City Co-op, without hesitation, jumped right in and said, what more can we do? And so they have pledged to continue helping build the scholarship fund along with the Moles' gift at a rate of $15,000 a year. And so we are very proud of that, and we're very excited about that. And the Endowment Association themselves, um, we have been a member of the Garden City Co-op since 1979 when we received a gift of farmland. Um, and so every year I talk with the co-op and sell grain to benefit uh, the students at Garden City Community College. So it's been a long relationship, and it's been a very good relationship for the Endowment Association, and a very good relationship for the college and for the community. And so I'm pleased to present this year's Outstanding Service Award to the Garden City Co-op. Thank you very much, Jeremy. It is an honor to be here tonight to represent the 2,400 members of the Garden City Co-op and the seven-member board of directors. Jeremy's exactly right. When we were once again led by Otis and Mary Lee, to give back and to make this community and make the agricultural community and make Kansas stronger, we were proud to jump in. And so Mary Lee and Otis, thank you for your leadership. Once again, you're breaking trail for us and we're following along and we're proud to do that. We're proud to be associated with this wonderful organization of the Garden City Community College. Thank you.